Hi, students, and uh, welcome to week four. I know that the weeks are kind of getting a little scrambled here, but uh, this week is starting to kind of pan itself out a little bit and be a little bit more back to normal. So here's what we're thinking. We're going to do, do our reading for the week. It's going to be Zinzer, right? Uh, I have a link for long sentences, right? Labyrinthine sentences. So we have to learn to control our sentence structures, our links go for variety to create interest, and that's a prime uh, point this week. And then uh, this is something that is critical. Students who succeed in this course grasp this next concept, and it's in the discussion board, and it's the idea of descriptive writing within a short period of time. Too many, too many times we're, we're covering months at a time, right? And it's, it's too much, right? A lot happens in a month. A lot happens in five minutes. So I really want you to, to just slow down and to think about anything, even during the day, just a five minute span of time. What happened? What were the sights? What were the sounds? What was the significance, right? And drive home the details, drive home the metaphors, uh, you know, go literally, go figuratively, right? Really mix it up. And this is this will strengthen your writing muscles for showing and not telling, which we say over and over again, show, don't tell. Think about five minutes. And then lastly, a memoir free write. This is the first of a big writing assignments for the course. And again, it's kind of throwing up in your typewriter. I want you to not think about a long event for your memoir. Think about a very short event. One of the, some of the best ones I've had written um, were when a lady uh, wrote about one night, you know, just one evening around a campfire and that was like it, right? Um, keep it short, keep that timeline tight and uh, it'll help out a lot. Hope you enjoy it.